Very dangerous mad activity in a building across from the Oceanville Zoo. I'm going in. Over. A large meteorite fell into the Atlantic Ocean last night off the coast of Oceanville. The meteorite is apparently made of a rare but rather useless mineral. <laughs> Not useless for everybody. <laughs> Great news indeed, sir. The astronium is just waiting for us. Fortunately, no one has realized the value of this extraordinary mineral. <laughs> Nothing can stop us now! My full-size atomic molecular transforming machine is almost ready. And I still have enough astronium left for the prototype to carry on. Excellent. Once we've retrieved the Astronium Meteorite, I'll be able to put my full-size AMTM in orbit around our planet. And ransom the billionaires of the world. <laughs> Dr. Claw is up to no good once again. I've got to... experimenting with some device that transforms people into animals. A CIA special agent, Ronald Foxy, was investigating this strange phenomenon when he himself was transformed into a fox. By the way, he should be in your office shortly, Nose Hair. I told the CIA we'd get our best man on the case. General, uh, I am really honored. So call Gadget, or introduce him to Agent Foxy and put him on the case. Hi, I'm Agent Ronald Foxy. Are you Lieutenant Gadget? Certainly not. <laughs> I am Colonel Nozair, Gadget's boss. Welcome to Womp, Agent Foxy. So, where is Lieutenant Gadget? I've been informed of his special skills. I can't wait to meet him. Uh, rest assured, he is worth the wait. <laughs> Gadget! Good morning, Colonel Nozair. Lieutenant Gadget reporting for duty, sir. Good morning, Gadget. Dr. Claw is illegally turning humans into animals, and, uh... I see. Mad agents in disguises. An easy case. Let me introduce you to your partner <laughs> for this mission, Agent Foxy. Wowzers. Colonel Nozer, you've got a new dog. And you've dressed it like a man? Great way to trick mad agents in disguise. Genius, sir. Simply genius. Gadget. Agent Foxy is not... A dog! Of course he's not just a dog. He's your companion. I know the feeling. Well, actually, he's a fox. Excuse me. I am not a fox. I am a CIA agent. <laughs> and a talking one, too. That's great. Compliments on your ventriloquist act, sir. You almost fooled me. Well, let's make it short, huh? You need to investigate a mad plot involving animal transformations. Agent Foxy will fill you in on the details. Oh, sure he'll fill me in. That's a good doggy doggy Foxy Woxy, yes? Oh, there's a good boy. Good boy, huh? <laughs> oh, that feels good. Oh, yeah. Oh. Stop, stop. Colonel, do something. Make him stop. Uh. <laughs> you know, I've got a lot of experience with pets on the job. Atomic molecular transformation. More or less the way mutant mice are created in labs. Hmm. The trick with pets is to keep them busy. In fact, let me demonstrate. Go, go, gadget dog kick. First the bone. Then the leash. Good boy, Colonel. Now let's see if your dog is as good as you. Go, go, Gadget Tennis Ball. Time to go. Come here, 
doggy. Have fun, Colonel. Foxy and I have got to save the world. <laughs> Oceanville, and mad agents in animal disguises are running around this town. It's our mission to find them all. <laughs> and we even have Colonel Nosehair's favorite pet uh, to help us. For the 500th time, I am not a pet. I am a CIA agent. I've served for over 20 years, earned 35 medals. And... Oh, sure, Digit. You're a very important agent with lots of experience. I pride myself in building these privates' confidence. Why don't you listen to me? You have to follow me. This is my case. Sure, sure. Now, I know you privates are excellent ventriloquists, but can I please save it for later? <laughs> I must be going mad. I bet this pig is, in fact, a human. But of course, this mad agent's got the perfect disguise. Privates, see Lieutenant Gadget's brilliant mind at work. This ought to be good. What is the essential element differentiating humans from animals? Paychecks. Laughter, boys. Laughter. Mad agents disguised as animals can't fool us. If we can make them laugh, we've got them. Go, go, Gadget tickling devices. <laughs> <laughs> Privates, this one's loud. We found our first manic. Go, go, get your handcuffs. Precious time. I have to do something to get this nincompoop on track. Hey, tickle me. Hello, I'm here. See, I can laugh. I'm a human. One more. These mad agents in disguise are no match for me. Aha. Yeah. Mad Agent Arrest in Wamp's history. Colonel knows there will be so proud. Hi, Benny. Guys, I've run a satellite scan, and there seems to be strong radiation coming out of the building across from the zoo. Go there and call me. No problem, Penny. We're on it. Or rather, under it. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you could have given us a hand. Excuse me, I am a CIA agent, not some servile robot. Yeah, right. Foxy, 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 good boy. Hmm. Nothing servile about that. Listen, Agent Foxy, you want your human form back, right? We can help you if you help us. You see, uh, Lieutenant Gadget really is a genius in his own personal kind of way. And if you just play along and lead him to the building across the street, you might be surprised. Oh, wowzers. I think Foxy wants to have some fun. Go, go, Gadget Rollerblades. I think he's smelling mad agents, Lieutenant. You bet. That's where I spied mad activities and where I got transformed. Good boy, Foxy. Privates, check inside this house while I reward our Foxy with a special gadget treat. We're here. This place is guarded like the crown jewels. Is there any way you can get the spy bug in there so we can see what's going on? Spy bug is in, Penny. And I've got a visual. 
Dr. Claw, it's done! The full-size atomic molecular transformation machine is now a reality! And to show my trust in this powerful technology, let me demonstrate on myself! I place a nugget of astronium inside and... What happened? He ate it! Don't lose him! I'll try to find out more about this atomic molecular transformation machine and the astronium. More astronium and we'll be able to transform anyone into their animal counterpart. Then they'll have to pay us a hefty ransom to turn them back. Which brings us to a little problem. What problem? Well, someone needs to get the Astronium meteorite from the bottom of the ocean without being seen. Simple. Go to my lawyer's office in Oceanville with your AMTM prototype. Your lawyers? But why, sir? Because my lawyers are the most dangerous sharks you've ever seen. Good one! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Guys, I know why they need astronium. To convert human DNA into its animal DNA counterpart. Claw's gonna get it from the meteorite that fell into the ocean. Beat you to it, Penny. Claw just dumped a bunch of lawyers into the ocean. Lawyers? Yep. Transform them into sharks. I should compliment Colonel Nosehair on Foxy's excellent training. This amazing dog can smell clues even in the water. Good boy, Foxy. What? Hey, if you can't beat him, join him, right? Look, a quaint little fishing boat. Let's ask this nice-looking fisherman if he's seen any mad agents here. The sharks are doing a great job. Phase B is 90% complete, Dr. Claw. You! Uh -huh. <gasps> Excuse me, Mr. Fisherman. Lieutenant Gadget here on official business. What? Gadget? Get rid of him immediately before he ruins our plan. Have you seen any strange-looking animals around here by any chance? Besides the ones on your boat? <laughs> nope, not a single one! But now I see an ugly-looking bird which will soon end up on my dinner plate. <laughs> on that antique harpoon you've got there. It is spotless. Harpoon? Ah! Ah! Hi, Benny. I was just about to call you. Have a look at your uncle. Well, I think the only solution is for me to build a copy of this AMTM. Digit, get me the machine's blueprint and some astrobium as fast as you can. I'll do my best. And you, Fidget, make sure Uncle Gadget doesn't fly away. Go, go, Gadget binoculars. Wowzers. <laughs> <laughs> I can see mad agents in disguise at every corner. Privates, handle the gadget boat, while Foxy and I head back. Go, go, gadget copter! Should be there. Ah, here's the astronium. Penny, come in. Blueprints are on the way. Upload successful. Good job, Digit.
We have to stop Claw from using the machine on a global basis. It looks like there's a satellite launch facility approximately five miles north of your location. You follow Toad, and I'll meet you there as soon as I'm done with the machine. Lieutenant! <laughs> yes! Whoops! Bridget, bring the lieutenant to a satellite launch facility five miles north of here. And he's ordered. Why do I always have the dirty jobs? Three, two, one, fire! A complete success, Dr. Claw! In about 30 minutes, the AMTM will be in place and ready to transform whoever you want into their animal counterparts! <laughs> Oh, and the best part is, Gadget is out of commission! Excellent! This time, Gadget, I win! What is that? What is what? That metal's a minor bird, sir! And a truck of animals! How did he find us? <laughs> Gadget, sir! What? Stop that bird brain! No! Whoa! Whoa! Hey! Whoa! Whoa! Someone tell me what's going on. We're pulling the lieutenant in. Can't you see? Wowzers. A mad agent disguised as a bird. This is getting really creative. Mad Agent, you have been discovered. You're under arrest. Come and take us if you dare. <gasps> oh, no! It's feeding time for the sharks. <laughs> Boss, it's done. Gadget and his friends are finished. Dead meat. Wowzers! The situation is getting fishy. Oh, stop tickling! How many times do I have to tell you I am not edible? Back off, Buster! Gentlemen, very wise of you to take off your disguises. Now you're all under arrest, and I command you to tell me who your leader is. Yeah. Yeah. What? Quick, we've got to deactivate the AMTM on the satellite before Claw gets to use it. Fidget, I'm gonna need a little help from you. Stop! You're under arrest! Huh? Ah! Gadget again! <laughs> sure this is really safe? Trust me, I'll walk you through it, so to speak. You'll be fine. Here's the device you need to place on the AMTM so I can control it from here. Stop immediately, mad agent! <laughs> it's me, Foxy. I am a CIA agent. No one's faster than Lieutenant Gadget. Don't go Springway! No use putting your costume back on. You are uncovered. Lieutenant, watch out! Go, go, gadget propeller! between you and me, Dr. Claw. Uh-oh. Not good. I hate you and your gadgetinis!
Congratulations, Gadget. You've returned Agent Foxy, retransformed, given us the blueprint, stopped Mad's evil plan. Good job, Harley. Yes, sir. I understand why you'd be angry. I lost your dog, and, and now you're all alone. He was not my dog. He was a fox. I mean, I mean, he wasn't a fox. He was an agent. Yes, he was all of that, and so much more, sir. I'm sorry. That's it? <laughs> He's gone? <laughs> I am safe and he is gone? <laughs> I can't believe he's gone! Nothing can happen to me now! What is it? Private Fidget reporting, sir. Uh, sorry about the ceiling. And the desk. <sighs> Yes, Gadget's trainee. I see you're taking after him. Thank you, sir. Ah! <laughs> 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 